<laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't know you were asleep. Why did you come to bed? I have a nightmare. About what? The fire. Explain everything to her when I get back to see him. I'm sorry, you, you missed the last ferry yesterday. Look, it's not your fault, Rory. got made himself busted. It did work out, though. We got the fake passports. Look, okay, so you two head up to Canada. I'll head back down to Salem. And a whole new life. Where I don't have to be afraid of the law. When do I get out of here? When I say so. Welcome to the New Salem, Rory. You know, Rory, I think I'm gonna leave you right here in this room with little Jennifer Horton. She's gonna tell you what to think and who to be. And I do believe that after some time, you are gonna be dying to tell me what I need to know. So have fun. Wait, no, wait, what, what does that mean? Hold on. Rory. You've been such a good friend to JJ. Don't give up on him now. <laughs> Wait a minute. You put Rory and Jennifer in there together? Uh, yes, I did. But neither one will tell me anything about JJ. Still? Rory hasn't gone this long without drugs since nursery school, so I figured the combination between that and Jennifer, well, maybe that'll make him a little more top it. I'm thinking what's needed here. As the leverage make Jennifer more talkative. How about this? What? Xander Kiriakis testifies in court as a witness to Jennifer beating on me. Come on, Jack. You don't think it's going to go that far, do you? Well, probably not, but Jennifer doesn't know that, does she? But how are you going to get her to help you with JJ? I mean, my guy has interviewed her. And they seem to think that she's telling the truth about not knowing where he is or how to reach him. Well... Unfortunately, we don't need our help to settle that score. Like sands through the hourglass, so are the days of our lives. It's me again. Um, sorry, I, I, I didn't leave a message last time. I just, uh, look, I'm, I'm here in 